Hello, dear students. Welcome back to my class. I'm Dr. Indrai Nikati, and in this today's video, I'm going to deal with the material turnover ratio, which is every year a compulsory question for five marks. Okay. So if you this is very simple. If you learn this, you will RMC score five marks. So let's take an uh, example or a problem from the question paper earlier, question paper only. Okay. So from the information relating to a store item M and N, two items are given to you, material M and N, compute their turnover ratio. That is, these are the materials. So we are going to calculate material turnover ratio and express it in number of days, okay? So after calculating the material turnover ratio, you will have to express the same thing in number of days for the month of June 2021, okay? So this question is from 2022, okay? Now let's look at the information provided to you. Opening stock, purchases and closing stock. These three informations are given only for one month, okay? So that's why these are the amounts given. Let's begin without wasting your much of time, okay? So material turnover ratio, what is the formula for this? Tell me, this is cost of materials consumed divided by average stock. Simply if you write materials consumed, that is also okay. But we are going to take the cost here. That's why cost of material consumed divided by average stock. This is a formula to calculate MTOR. MTOR is material turnover ratio. Okay. So let's come to the working notes. So here, working notes I have made. Okay. These are the working notes, right? And uh, if you, you know, uh, besides only if you do the working notes, it's much better. Okay. That's why working notes I've noted here only. What are those? First working note is calculation of cost of material consumed. How to calculate the cost of materials consumed. Okay. So do three columns or a simple table wherein what is the formula to cost calculate the cost of material consumed is opening stock, add purchases, less closing stock. If you do this, you will get the cost of materials consumed. Okay. The same thing I have written here, you know. What is this? Opening stock. Okay. What is the opening stock? It is given in the problem only, you know, 25,000, 40,000, 25, 40, I have noted down. So add purchases. Purchases are also given to you, 50,000, 1 lakh. If you add 50,000 to 25, it becomes 75. Add 1 lakh to 40,000, total is 1 lakh 40,000. It is of M, it is of N, okay? In this, what you are going to do? Less closing stock. So what is the closing stock given here? 15,000 and 20,000. So deduct these 15,000 and 20,000 from 75,000 and 1 lakh 40,000. So 75 minus 15, it will be 60,000. 1 lakh 40,000 minus 20,000, it is 1 lakh 20,000. One thing we have derived, that is cost of materials consumed, 60,000 and 1 lakh 20,000. So here, you know, for let's begin uh, the another working note that is which is required, that is lower part, okay, average stock. So let's calculate the average stock. Simple formula to calculate the average stock is opening stock plus closing stock divided by 2. So what is the opening stock of M? It is given in the problem only, no? Opening stock of M is 25, closing stock is 15, okay? So here, 25,000 plus 15,000 divided by 2. Okay, divided by two. This is the formula. What is the answer that you derive here? The total becomes 40,000. 40,000 divided by two is equal to rupees 20,000. Okay, the final answer as a average stock for material M, it is not A and B, M and N. Okay, by mistake, it is written M and N. So let's come to the N also. What is the opening stock of N? It's given in the problem or else in the chart also I have written here. Opening stock is 40,000. Okay. Closing stock is 20,000. 40,000 plus 20,000. How much it is? 60. So let's write 40,000 plus 20,000 divided by 2. Okay. So this is divided by 2. Again, we will get what is the answer. 40 plus 20 is 60. 60 divided by 2 is equal to rupees 30,000. Okay. So both the answers we got. Let's come to the final calculations. Right. So what is this? Material turnover ratio. Material turnover ratio formula, it's already written. 
what is the material turnover ratio formula my uh, dear students tell me this is cost of materials consumed divided by average stock so cost of materials consumed is 60000 right here for material m okay this is material n cost of materials consumed just now we have derived it as 60000 in the working note okay and of n is how much 120000 right 20,000 divided by average stock. Average stock is rupees MS 20 and N is 30. Okay. 20,000. And here it is 30,000. Yeah. So 60,000 divided by 20,000 is equal to 3. This answer is in terms of times. Okay. Here is equal to 4, right? Karta hodi pe kili, mooron le, mooron le, hanner do. So, uh, the answer you get is 4 times. Okay. Now, in terms of days, second question that is asked to you to calculate the material turnover ratio express in terms of number of days for the month. Okay. So, that's why the formula to calculate the MTOR in terms of days is days in a month. In fact, it is days in a year divided by MTOR. But here, one month information is given. That's why days in a month divided by MTOR. Days in a month are how much? 30 days in the June month. Okay. So that's why 30 days divided by MTOR just now calculated as 3. Right. And for this, Days in a month is again 30 days, okay, divided by 4, right? So here we have done the thing and finally we'll have to find out the answer. That is the first one. How much do we get here? 30 days divided by 3 is equal to 10, right? Sorry, 10 I have not written. You will have to write here 10 days. So here, how much do we get the answer? Yes, 30 divided by 4 is equal to 7.5, right? 7.5 days. That is, you can write in round of figure also, like 8 days, okay? So here, you will get within 5 minutes, you know, within 2-3 minutes, you will get 5 marks. Wish you all the very best. Practice this. Uh, be very much, uh, what do you know? Uh, I had this formula, material turnover ratio, cost of material consumed divided by average stock and how to calculate the cost of material consumed, opening stock plus purchases, less closing stock. And average stock, as everybody knows, opening stock plus closing stock divided by two of both the materials, okay? So after this, you will get the material turnover ratios in terms of times and that you need to convert in terms of 10 days. So material M requires 10 days. Material N requires 7.5 days, okay? So this is what is the calculation of material turnover ratio, okay? I'll stop my video. Kindly share the video to your friends. Subscribe to my channel too, okay? Wish you all the very best.